What's everybody? Multi fire lasers coming to you with another YouTube video. It's you know it, Crypto Muscle International Renown Worldwide Syndicated and Worldwide Phenomenon and Worldwide, the most electrifying YouTuber there is today. I mean, you know it. I mean, it's Crypto Muscle. Coming to you with another YouTube video. Yeah, I am your anti-hero hero in the space. And, um, yeah. I'm just sending a message out there. That's all I'm doing. Because I'm seeing what I'm seeing and I present what I present. That's it. I'm not anything involved in it at all whatsoever. But when I see a new information, I like to share it. So here it is. Crypto Future version 2.0. All right. And yes, it is, <laughs> I mean, how, how do I say it? But um, of course, we all have to be skeptical because we don't know what their intention is or his intention is, right? And so that's why, you know, you got to keep your guards up and go from there, right? For me, I'm just going to watch from the sidelines. And if it does look like something may come from it, then maybe. I might try my hand at it in, in it once again. But if not, well, shit, <laughs> I'm staying off of it, right? So that's just my mode right now on how I'm looking at it. And so because with this, it could go it could go either way. It could go really bad. And, you know, you're like, oh, shit, you know, and there they go. They're gone again. Or, they, or their intention is actually good and they're actually going to actually pay people back. But... The, the thing is, though, that gray area is about you got to redeposit something new again because of his so-called mining and trading and stuff that he does. So with that, uh, new information today just came out today. And so I figured why not talk about it since new information is posted. And, of course, we always find it in a trusty, to me, trusty, reliable source uh, because a lot of information does come from there, which is right here in the space. Boom, there it is. So, in Telegram, here we go again. Version 2.0 is a total restoration of Jafur Rabir's integrity. Uh, is a total restoration of the lost. 2.0 is a total restoration of leaders' trust in humanity. Uh, security protection has been taken care of. Not authorization of been hacked anymore uh, er, version 2.0 won't authorize old login but will accept same registration details as of old will to be properly recognized as old membership from support team all right most important thing you all need to know is that do not speak against Jaffer he only needs support to rebuild back trust from investors he can't keep hiding if everyone do not recover their capitals uh, Jaffer can't keep hiding when he has good technology, which everyone witnessed in Dubai and UK office, and the Crypto Future ATM card coming soon to enable global distribution of Crypto Future ATM machine. So that part right there says it's still a go, right? If you trust that. And why shall him keep hiding when mining technology is working perfectly? His customized trading software that generate profit daily is working perfectly. And Jaffer didn't mean any harm to anyone and needs support to rebuild back strongly. This idea of version 2.0 came up as a result of been discussed with. Uh, he needs to circulate around the nation. The product, that is. Uh, as it has already crossed many countries, Crypto Future MasterCard has been processed for global distribution of Crypto Future ATM machines and enabled Everyone to withdraw their crypto directly from ATM while doing such transaction fees will also be earned by Jaffer as product owner. This dream can't be killed because of the version 1.0 challenge. Many company closed because they officially do not have legal product to stand on. All right, so I guess he's trying to say, they're trying to say, or who's trying to, whoever's trying to say, is that um, he's still trying to come up with this ATM machine and credit card concept or not credit card uh, debit card concept and because the big picture is 
if everybody's pulling money out of these ATM machines use, utilizing these cards, well, the fees that are involved with that, he collects on his end. So why would he want to stop that machine from going, right? On top of the trading that he does, the mining that he does. This is just what I'm trying to translate into, uh, you know, layman's terms for you guys here. So that is why Crypto Future version 2.0 is coming up for mega support and will be globally launched. Mega launcher will take off from Russia. Uh, we've been talking about that now in the last couple of videos. Everyone will see Jaffer speaking boldly about the failure of 1.0. Do not sound negative. Do not spam Jaffer's inbox. To remain in here, you need to be positive, create your personal group, add your leaders, encourage them to be proactive. If your team wish to support Jaffer, is very cool. If they don't want to, very cool, but do not write to Jaffer's inbox. And so I am here to support and answer your respective questions from the support team. Furthermore, security protection of the version 2.0. No more top leader will get close to Jaffer's trading room. All right, so that was what was the accusation was that he had, you know, a few top leaders with him. And so when he had to be away because of, he said COVID, he had COVID and he had to be in quarantine. Uh, that's when they raided his uh, place, uh, you know, wherever he has his stuff and emptied out, and raided his accounts and emptied it out is what was said here. And has it happened during 2.0? I mean, the only... Only thing I could give to Jaffer is that those leaders, he should just name them, right? You name these people, and if we haven't heard from those very people, then we know they took the money, right? I mean, that's, I don't know, I'm just, just saying, I don't know. Because you, you should name those people, put them out there, and say, hey, such and such, you know, this guy took it, this guy took it, this guy took it. If you guys didn't take it, want you speak about it, but they won't speak about it. He won't speak about it. But, you know, it'd be kind of interesting to see who actually did and if he's, you know, who's he's accusing. Uh, no support team will be allowed to get close to the mining machine and trading software when version 2.0 get launched. No leader would be allowed to disturb Jaffer until everyone regained their lost. So he's, he's on his own mission until otherwise is what they're saying. Therefore, uh, version 2.0 will be totally be handled by Jaffer alone he will only control the mining and trading no more trust anymore okay that's, that's kind of funny no more trust anymore uh official launch will commence in russia the country may change depending on country uh that offer high support right now russia is really supporting positively uh indonesia is also supporting in indian i guess india so indonesia that's an Asian country, India, and so on, Peru, and so on. Launching a version 2.0 would be done in a country that supported the highest to enable maximum protection of Jaffer's life against angry leaders. Thanks, support team. It's a lot of support team putting out this information. Uh, let's break down version 2.0 marketing. Direct referrals now 10%. Residual income flows according to the indirect teamwork, and they're earning up to 55%. Team bonus daily ranges from 7% to half a percent indirect commission. Um, I guess that's from level one down, right? That's what that means. Because, you know, it starts big and it goes small. Um, packages. So daily profits according to your level of packages. $100 up to $3,000. You earn 1% daily for those packages. 5000 to 15000 is 2% daily. And then 20000 and up, it's 3% daily. Earnings vary according to your package. And this is to enable everyone to earn their capitals back faster and get refunded from the old crypto future. Do not worry if your money is hanging on old crypto future because new version will enable everyone to gain weight over and over again. Daily fix will enable you to regain back your capital faster and more ecosystem will be added. Those who speak negatively should not be forced to be pressured to join. Or be part of the new version, for I need only cool and positive leaders who are optimistic to work with me in the new version. You are expected to discard every leader who speaks bad of me and says, I, I am a scammer and says that's trying to use 2.0 to scam again. Right? That's the skepticism part, right? Of course, people are, let me just kind of skim through this. 
Yeah, people were going to, you know, be skeptical. I mean, it's just natural to be skeptical because of what happened before. So 1% to 3% daily, it depends on the package. So you can see the breakdown. All right, 100 to 3,000 is 1%. 5,000 to uh, 15,000 is 2%. And then 20,000 up to 100,000 is 3%. So you can see that there. Uh, we talked about that. We covered that. Residual. Um, and then this stuff here is all geared towards if you are building up that massive team and all that. So let's see here. And they're saying they're not forcing anybody to rejoin. They're not saying, oh, man, you got to come back. They're just saying, if you want to join, you join. If you don't, you don't. Um, they don't need everybody is what they're saying. For everyone who did not have money or the funds to join the new version, I'm sorry to say that money was lost in the old version, and I don't know next to do in other to settle everyone at a reasonable amount of money was being stolen from the mining when I was isolated over COVID-19. You do not need to blame me. I didn't appear over in Punta Cana due to what happened after discovering the incident. I got disappointed and paid thousands of dollars for your flight ticket in preparation of the event in Punta Cana when I noticed some leaders have stolen a great money from mining. I failed to speak to you on Zoom. Reason is that I did not know what to answer if questions flow. Oh, yeah, you're going to have a lot of angry people when that happened. Uh, you know, not showing up. And then you, you talk about this. Whew, it was going to be, this is going to go bad. Uh, I believe you trusted me and trusted our machine. We are here to change lives and assure you that a crypto future brand will never be tarnished or to be dealt. Well, it's already in, it is kind of tarnished because of what happened. Duh, right? Um, and to be dealt with by bad officials anymore. We shall start all over again a new version with new marketing that will enable us to start again and last for five good years. Whew, that's a, that's a stretch. Believe me or not, a lot of leaders who understand me will support us very much and we are ready to kick off first week of December. There you go. Launching is scheduled to be first or second week of December and those who join so immediate with me and build a team will be allowed to see me again. Officially, new version launching will be held in Russia, where I'll be speak to you who joined the new version. That'd be interesting if he shows his face again. You can keep reporting my identity over the old loss of old crypto future, but nothing will be done by the government until a new legal solution is out. We all have to start all over again and to solicit you back your capital and your profit and keep working with us. Our ecosystem strongly waiting for our instant proof of, lo of loyalty. New ecosystem will be welcome, such as cold fund and e-commerce. To those who trust again with us, I'm excited to welcome your support and say thank you for your understanding, blah, blah, blah. So this is a presentation link, which is what I've showed you guys here. Uh, you don't think Jafer Repair plans to hide without thinking on how to solve the present problem through version 2.0. Don't forget the good part of Crypto Future, version 1.0, there is no uh, perfect in any business, but when given a challenge arises, it left for the CEO to make a total solution and move on. Coming back of Crypto Future version 2.0 will put smiles on your face. Blah, blah, blah. Ugh, that's too much. Uh, we all shouldn't forget the good times of Crypto Future. Blah, blah, blah. All right, so they're just trying to rehash old memories now. Uh, all we have to do is, uh, blah, blah, blah. All right, so that's that. Uh, Rabir is somewhere making haste to make sure that you smile again. Uh, bear with him as the highly expected version is launched again. So, first or second week December is what's coming. This is what is where it's at. Money to Friday day withdrawals will be pawned, receive 20, 12 to 20, 48 hour business hours. Uh, minimum withdrawal is 100. All right, uh, 300% still. So, you're going to get triple the Bitcoin, whatever you put in. Uh, withdrawal fee is every 5%. Or Friday, every Friday, 5%. So that's what they got. Um, I think it said, what, Litecoin, USDT are the only two, not Bitcoin. So Litecoin in, USDT, and Litecoin in, or out, <laughs> USDT out. So that's the latest on in all this stuff. A lot of information to share there. Um, so basically, you really have to have money put in to get more money out if you choose to believe it. So... Just do your research, and uh, I'm just sharing this information as it came today, you know, new information as they're ramping up for this uh, relaunch now into 2.0. So comment down below, and I'll see you next one.